Willkommen zurück zu einer neuen Folge von Sam and Max. So. Stinky cell phone. But why would she have left it behind? Especially since she's got 18 months left on her contract. Either there was some kind of struggle, or it was left here for us to find, and we're walking right into a trap. I've got it. She waived her early cancellation fees with a recommended device upgrade. So now we know two things. You're an idiot, and this phone is going to lead us directly to General Skunk Ape, somehow. Hm. Ja, nehmen wir doch mal mit. What's in there? As far as I can tell, a bunch of temp workers who'd never seen a six foot tall dog peeking in their window before. Hm. Interessant. So, ich glaube, sonst ist hier aber erstmal nichts zu machen. Dann. Ähm. Oh, eine Kuh. So, ah, genau, wir können einfach zu Sibyl wieder zurück. Da wissen wir, wo das Handy liegt. Sehr praktisch. So, jetzt... Warte mal, ja, dürfen wir eigentlich... Oh, der Typ ist wahrscheinlich wieder unterwegs. Das ist Gang -Ape. Können wir jetzt denn mal in diesen Raum... Oder, ja genau, erzähl mal, wie du es fandest. Sam und Max, do not trust Skunkape. His benevolent facade belies a heart of pure evil. Uh, yeah, we kind of already figured that out. The giant fang spaceship with disintegrator eyes was our first clue. Are you calling me gullible? Uh, what? Look, I don't know what planet you're from. This one, actually. But on my world, if an alien invites you onto his spaceship, you don't just assume that he's going to cut out your brain and keep it in a jar. I guess we're just not that cynical. To be fair, Max, your future vision goggles did tip us off. You mean, you wield the eyes of Yog sagoth But, but that must mean you also have the gift. Okay. What's that mold processing room all about? Isn't it obvious? General Skunkape is illegally harvesting mold juice. Mold juice? What did you look like back when you had a body? Oh, nothing exceptional. About 6'3", raven-haired. I had what you Earthlings call a runner's build. I can read minds in the future, you know. All right, fine. I believe the closest creature you have on your planet is called a platypus. What is Skunk Ape's evil scheme, anyhow? No less than domination of the entire universe! Did he ever mention anything more specific? He's traveling from planet to planet, searching for all the toys of power. If he ever manages to collect all of them, he'll be completely unstoppable! Why did Skunk Ape come here, to our street? He's been using my strange psychic connection to the Toys of Power to track them throughout the galaxy. Something very powerful pulled me to this spot. I can only guess it was Max's discovery of the eyes of Yog sagoth and the future vision. How are we supposed to stop Skunk Ape? Any weaknesses, like he's powerless against the color yellow, or he can't cross running water? Or he's powerless against yellow water? I know what you're thinking, Max, and stop it. Well, of course, the toys of power are useless to him without a gifted brain to control them. Apart from that, he always says he has a weakness for potato chips, and he has to eat the whole bag. Yeah, that doesn't really help us much. Sometimes, when he's in the shower, I could swear I hear him crying. Okay. What's your story, Brain? Can we get you anything? Like a spine? No, it's too late for me, I'm afraid. I can only help you put a stop to General Skunkape's evil schemes by controlling the doors and the higher functions of this spaceship. We must work quickly before... What is in this broth? Is that oregano? It's delightful. Stay focused, pal. How did you get here? I had found a mysterious toy and was using my strange power over it to amaze and delight the ladies of my village. It was then that Skunkape's ship landed. 
He was intrigued with my power and invited me on board his spaceship. So you just went with him? He said he had candy. How was I supposed to know he'd imprison me here, forcing me to use my psychic powers against my will? In the future, you seem to know all about Max's psychic powers. Yes, Max is one with the gift. The toys have great power, but only to those of us with a special brain. Well, Max does have a special brain. That's what all the teachers said. Well, that and back, back, I cast thee out, demon. You must use the gift wisely, Max, and keep it secret from General Skunkape. The power is every bit as dangerous as it is wicked awesome. Why do you think Max's powers are dangerous? Apart from the obvious, of course. General Skunkape can't use the toys of power himself, so he needs the brain of someone who has the gift. He forced me to use my powers so much that I would have died had you not rescued me. If he ever found out you have the gift, Max, he wouldn't hesitate to do the same to you. Okay, okay. that's all the evidence we need. Let's go out and deliver some interplanetary justice, Max. If you end up cutting out his brain, I call dibs on Skunkape's body. Kriegen wir schon hin. So, können wir jetzt mal hier rein? Hey Brain, can you open this door for us? You want to go into the mole processing room? But it's a horrible place. Official business. Besides, it's for mole people only. Perfect! We're part mole man! Odd, you don't look molish. By marriage. There were rituals. Very well, I will try. Welcome. Congratulations. Prepare yourself for a fabulous off-world vacation, courtesy of General Skunkape. I'm very excited. Why aren't there any doors? You'll feel a slight tingle as we take your personal items for safekeeping. Slight tingle? Oh, hey now! Oh, screw the vacation! I want to keep doing this! Error. Cannot remove inventory. Where do you keep your personal items? It's none of your damn business, computer. Very well. Beginning Mole Man processing. Sam, why is the floor so slippery? For the comfort of guests waiting outside, please refrain from screaming or crying out. Do you smell something burning? Sam, why haven't we ever seen any mole people come out of here? Enjoy the rest of your experience, and remember that your sacrifice is for the glory of General Skunkabe. Sacrifice? Are we going to die, Sam? Depends on whether we can think of a way out of this death trap, little buddy. Hmm. Huh. Come on, you know Oh no, all my stuff is locked inside that container. Na gut, wir haben ja äh, unser Teleport-Device. Für Notfälle. Ähm. Ach komm, warum nicht? Nehmen wir Stinky Steiner. So, das hat ja schon mal funktioniert. Mittlerweile irgendwie jemand wieder hier. Ah ja, hi. Not even the freelance police can put me in a bad mood today. Do your worst. Oh, new thing! <laughs> it is pretty cool, isn't it? But don't touch! And no animals on the counter! We've had a sudden change of heart. We think Skunk Ape is awesome. Where do we sign up to join the Skunk Ape Army? You two? In the Skunk Ape Army? Don't make me laugh! We're really good at not making people laugh. Why can't we be in the Skunk Ape Army? For starters, have you ever actually hit anything with that gun of yours, Fido? Now that's just not nice. And as for Harvey here, he'll be a fine soldier until we run into a you must be this tall to invade this planet sign. Uh-oh, you made him angry. Ah, uh, scheint so. Settle down, Max. Isn't that brooch a little fancy pants for you, Grandpa Stinky? 
Tain't a brooch, you cretin. It's a badge of honor. General Skunkap was so grateful for my donation that he made me his second in command. That badge looks dangerous, Grandpa Stinky. You'd better let us have it. Let you have it? This badge gives me command over General Skunkapi's entire Fifth Legion and Outer Dominions. I'm not going to give it to the likes of you. Where are his Outer Dominions exactly? I don't know. He told me to command them from inside the diner. I think it stretches from Alpha Centauri to the Andromeda Galaxy. And Brooklyn, of course. Can't we just borrow your badge? Ha! Even if you weren't a couple of shiftless ape traitors, my captain ordered me never to take it off. And to keep at least 50 feet away from him at all times for some reason. How's life as a multi-millionaire, Grandpa Stinky? So, you're starting to regret handing over that ticket, are you? I almost feel bad taking it from you, but consider it a life lesson. You're gonna be a lot more clever to outsmart an old salt like Stinky. What are you gonna do with all the money? Oh, I already gave it away. You what? To General Skunkapi. Haven't you heard him talk about the big plans he has for the planet? Inspiring. And since he made me his second in command, I never have to worry about money again. You just gave away hundreds of millions of dollars to an alien gorilla? You make it sound like I didn't get anything in return. I got this badge and command of an entire alien fleet. That is pretty cool, Sam. Well, yeah, especially if he threw in the badge. Oh, that's him to hiding. Skunk Ape's a total dillweed, Grandpa Stinky. We're placing him under arrest. Well, we're getting around to it. Eventually. Traitors! I knew it! Just wait until the General hears about this. You know where he is? Well, no. And I'm not supposed to go near him. But you two are in for a world of hurt once he gets my memo. General Skunk Ape's got you brainwashed, Grandpa Stinky. Yeah, and he hung you out to dry to avoid further shrinkage. Ha! You gentle, free-loving, hippie peacenik types just can't appreciate a real leader who's not afraid to use his weapons. He really doesn't know us at all, does he? This is your last warning, Grandpa Stinky. We're taking down the whole Skunk Ape army. Don't forget who you're talking to, traitors. As long as I wear this badge, my loyalty is with the General. Okay, this is your last warning, for real. We're taking down the whole Skunk Ape army. Don't forget who you're talking to, traitors. As long as I wear this badge, my loyalty is with the General. Okay, dann uh, habe ich da gerade eine Idee. We really want to join the Skunk Ape army, Grandpa Stinky. Max needs to pay for college. Why don't you ladies run back to your knitting and scrapbooking and leave the army work to the real men and gorillas? That does it! So. I'd better get out of here before things get violent. Yep, auf jeden Fall. So, mein Lieber, teleportieren wir doch mal eine Runde. So, und da wird es ja Stinkies haben. Get your hands off me! Oh, what have you done? Welcome back. Thank you for bringing friends along to celebrate the benevolence of General Skunkape. You'll feel a slight tingle as we take your personal items for safekeeping. No one's taken my personal gold and griddles! For the comfort of guests waiting outside, please refrain from screaming or crying out. Abort! For the love of Skunkape, abort! Voice print verified. Skunkape Army Sous Chef, 8th Class. Processing aborted. Sous Chef? 8th Class? After all I've done for that ungrateful monkey, he can keep his... Bloody 
Hm. Okay, dann sammeln wir mal. Sehr gut. Looks like Grandpa Stinky stuff got mixed in with all of mine. What has he got in his pockets? His victory badge from Skunk Ape and Jackpot! A collectible shot glass from Mr. Pizza. Sehr gut. Okay, dann äh, hätten wir jetzt hier das Zeug soweit schon mal zusammen. Hm. Können wir noch zu Mama Bosco? Können wir das Ding ja jetzt zurückgeben? Ich ja nicht. Naja, mal gucken, was Madame zu sagen hat. No visitors. Hey, you guys can't do that to me. Looks to me like we just did. At least give me back my sidekick. You'll get the rabbit once Jerome's done working him over. Okay. <lacht> Hey Space Gorilla, you're kind of blocking the door there. Mind if we scooch on by? We're closed. Okay. Vielleicht kommen wir jetzt ja hier oben irgendwie rein. Wir hatten ja hier die Feuerleiter. Pretty cool. Not useful though. Hm. Okay. Und was können wir Max ja auch irgendwie noch rum teleportieren? Ah, was haben wir denn da? All right, Pigeon. Hand over the shiny thing and nobody has to get hurt. Hey, careful where you drop that thing. Na toll. Kann ich da runter? Okay, dann schnappen wir uns das mal. So, dann kommen wir mal hier raus. It's an engagement ring. Hmm, I've got a feeling Skunk Ape picked it up while he was out looking for toys. Oh, there's an engraving. Hard luck. Classy. Okay. Max. Wie wär's, wenn wir uns mal raus teleportieren? Äh, Stinky, ja genau, dann sind wir eigentlich quasi da draußen. Okay, das ging einfacher als gedacht. So, und nun? Hey Space Gorilla, you're kind of blocking the door there. Mind if we scooch on by? We're closed. Ah, oh, this sucks, Sam. The old Bosco's never closed. I suspect Mama Bosco's got something in there that General Skunk Ape doesn't want us to find. Ah, ich, äh... Hm. Kommen wir da nochmal rein? Beat it. It's okay, sir. We're close personal friends of Mama Bosco's. Beat it. Mir fällt nämlich gerade was ein. Haben wir das jetzt verhauen? The name Bosco and Science go together like Church and State. Mhm, warte mal. Wo ist das letzte Autosave?
kommt da nämlich eine Idee. Okay, genau, du bist jetzt noch alleine. Sehr gut. Hello, Lamppost. What you knowing? Sheesh, what a jerk. Ja, echt. Eigentlich da hoch. Wenn wir nicht auf dem Ding stehen, könnten wir es ja so machen, dass dann der... Also, dass wir dann teleportieren. Ähm... The name Bosco and Science go together like Church and State. Jo. So, dann komm. Okay, Pigeon. Hand over the shiny thing and nobody has to get hurt. Hey, careful where you drop that thing. So, wenn wir jetzt nämlich teleportieren, sollte das ja eventuell funktionieren. Two in one blow, and without any significant injuries either. I think he crushed my trachea. Sehr praktisch. Gut, dann äh, schauen wir in der nächsten Folge mal, ob wir jetzt hier unten weiterkommen. Vielen Dank fürs Zuschauen. Ich hoffe, ihr hattet Spaß. Seid beim nächsten Mal dann wieder mit dabei. Und bis dahin, macht's gut und äh, ciao, ciao.